is the truck driver here in Brookhaven, and the first mission of today is actually going to be transporting some logs over to the farm. So, yep, here we got the logs. Let's go and get that attached over to the trailer. There we go. Backing it up nice and good. And I was going to get it attached. And boom, dude. Okay, so now the load is attached onto the trailer. Now we're going to make our way over to the farm. And you know what? I think I'm going to be taking this way over to the farm because, you know, it's less traffic this way. And yeah, it's a lot more open road because I'm transporting some long, long logs. So yeah, I kind of need a space for this. And over at the farm, I'm going to be meeting a farmer and hopefully he will actually pay me the money that he owes me for this service. So yeah, let's going to take a little left turn right here. There we go. And soon enough, we will have to take a right turn. But I'm just going to be laying on this side of the road because, you know, it's going to be a pretty tight one. Yep. And now we're taking another right turn. And yeah, there we got the farmer. Let's go have a chat with this guy. Howdy, partner. Hey, sir. Where do you want the logs, my man? I got all the logs he ordered. Inside of the barn, of course. Sure thing, my man. Okay, so let's go and get the logs inside of the barn. And yeah, we can basically just go ahead and drive through and hopefully it will fit. So yeah, let's go and make sure that it fits. Can we actually drop it off here? Okay, so now the logs will be in the barn. You know what? We can actually back them up I'll just a little bit. So yeah, that, I think that should be good. Yep. Okay, so yeah, let's go and have a chat with this dude again. Is this good, my man? Uh, does it seem perfect to you? Perfect job. How much will it be? Alright, nice. It will be $500 for the job, my man. And there we go. It just paid me my money. Here we are. Thanks, sir. You have a good one. You have a good one, my man. See ya. Okay, so there we go. That was the first job of today. Not bad, dude. We just made $500. So yeah, what we can actually go ahead and do now is drive back over to the... No, 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 no. You know what? We're actually picking up another load. And where we're going with this load is that we are going to be transporting it over to a mansion, I think it is. And it's going to be a lot of metal beams and stuff like that. Not really sure what it's going to be used for. But at least it is supposed to be behind the airport. So let's go ahead and drive on the airport and see if we can go ahead and find this trailer load. Alrighty, it should be behind here. So Oh, there it is. Okay, so I'm not really sure what this is. Is it a crane or is it metal beams? I'm not really sure. But it's definitely an oversized load. So yeah, this is actually going to be a little bit difficult to transport over to the mansion that we're delivering it to. But we just gotta try our best. And actually, I have to reverse it out of this little alley right here. So this can be actually a little bit difficult. But I just gotta take it like slow and easy. Go, let's go, let's go. Okay, we're trying to make this turn right here. And it's a really tight one. But at least if you go just slow enough, it should be fine. Yep, okay. Kind of like it smoothening out now. Yep. Okay, we got it. We got it out. Oh, dude. Okay, that was kind of stressful. So, yeah, the mansion we're delivering it to. It should be a mansion. Is it that? I'm not really sure if it's supposed to be a hotel. Anyways, let's go ahead and drive up towards the hotel and see if it, it's the correct address. I'm not really sure, though. We just gotta have to check. And, bro, driving around with the oversized load uh, through those uh, tight uh, streets like, yeah, we got here is actually pretty difficult. And, no, dude, I don't think this is the right destination. Oh, man. No, the mansion is around that side okay we just have to take a u-turn here oh man oh man will i be able to do this okay it's actually like a super tight one and i might actually hit that fountain right there oh i think it barely uh, worked yep okay now i was gonna get out of this place oh man this is super super difficult come on come on come on and yeah i kind of crashed it a little bit but it should be fine but anyways we're gonna make it over to the match right now because we got a customer that is waiting and maybe it's like trying to like uh, renovate his house because he needs this crane or metal beams or whatever this is on the back. At least it's super, super heavy and quite the huge load. So hopefully we'll make it up this hill right here. Yep, okay, we made it up. And what am I supposed to do here? Should I like back it up? Let's go to have a chat with the owner and see if he maybe wants me to back up the load. So where's the homeowner of this house? Anyways, let's go and ring the doorbell. Oh, he's there. He's cleaning some dishes, I think. Hello. Hey, sir. Uh, do you maybe want me to back it up? Or how do you want it delivered? Yeah, just put it in the garage. Okay, so he wants me to put the entire load in the garage. I'm not really sure if it's gonna fit in the garage, my man. Will it fit? Uh, bro, I think it's actually too tall, man. No, we won't be able to fit it, dude. It's way, way, way too tall for your small garage, my man. Huh, just back it up next to the Ferrari. Okay, sure thing, sure thing, my man. I can do that. So, yeah, we've got a little bit of space right here. So, he won't be to back it up right next to the Ferrari, which is super, super risky. Oh, man, oh, man. Oh, I don't really don't want to ruin his Ferrari because those cars are super, super expensive. And if I ruin it, I'm not really sure if I will be able to replace it because it's just way too expensive but anyways now we've got to try to back it up and bro this is actually going to be a pretty difficult challenge but we just got to try and solve it somehow because this is a pretty high paying customer and we just gotta have to try and satisfy him but anyways let's go and back up the law right here come on come on come on there we go okay we made it up we made it up now we just gotta make sure we ease it right next
next to the Ferrari and try not to hit it. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man, bro. We're so close to the Ferrari right now. It's definitely out of my comfort zone. But we're getting closer. We're getting closer. And we kind of have to stop it right now before it hits the rocks. And we can go ahead and release the cargo. And boom. That was actually super successful. There we go, sir. We made it right next to the Ferrari. Wow, that was well done. Yes. Thank you so much, sir. I kind of do this for a living, you know. You kind of get better at it. Let me grab you some money. Yeah, thank you, my man. Okay, so he's going inside of his house to grab some money. We just delivered this cargo. And, bro, this was not an easy part. Just look at this, dude. It was so close to the mountain. Look at this, dude. Whoa, man. So, yeah, we definitely had some precision on this delivery. But it was definitely needed. Or else we would have broken that Ferrari right there. Here's 10 grand. Wow, thanks, sir. That is a lot of money, my man. I think you just gave me a lot of cash and tips, which I do appreciate. Yeah, enjoy it. Bye. Yeah, bye, sir. You have a good one. You have a good one, my man. Okay, so there we go. Another successful delivery. We can go ahead and jump into the truck. And why is it not working? Hopefully, it's not broken, dude. Okay, there we go. The truck is actually working now. And, bro, it just crashed right in front of me. Sir, are you okay to drive, my man? Oh, man. Oh, look at that, bro. His Ferrari is literally smoking right now. What is this guy doing? Now it's burning? Oh, man. That guy is definitely crazy in the head. I'm not really sure what he's doing. And, bro, his wheel just popped off, man. What? Bro! Sir, are you okay, my man? Your wheels just flew all over the place, dude. Hopefully you're okay. Yeah, I'm okay, but can you take me to the mayor office? Yeah, sure thing, my man, sure thing. Because you did give me a pretty hefty tip earlier on. So I'm definitely going to be taking you over to the mayor's office. And that is over at the town hall, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, it should be a office inside of the town hall. So yeah, I was gonna bring this dude over there. And I'm not really sure what he was doing, bro. He literally just crashed an expensive Ferrari into the bridge. Which was kind of weird, but I think it should be in here, yeah? Thanks! Yep, here we go. This is the mayor's office. It's up in the second floor. Okay, so that was a pretty weird uh, little delivery right there. But we managed to do it. And what is going on here? Why are these two cars just parked next up to each other like this? Yo, are you guys okay? Why have you parked your cars like this? And why is she just checking out every grave here in Brooklyn? Bro, are you okay? Oh man, oh man, is she dancing weirdly? And what is going on? Let me oh! Oh, man, I just fell into a grave, bro. I'm not really sure if I was supposed to do that. And it says, let me out now. Rest in peace. What, dude? So, yeah, you. we definitely got a grave here. And, dude, I just clicked on the grave. It made an awful sound. Okay, I don't really like that. I think I should move away from here. What is going on? Why is there another truck right here? Is this by competition, dude? And why is this truck burning? You know what? Even though it's by competition, I'm going to be putting out that fire. Because it's a safety hazard. So, yeah, let's gonna grab a fire extinguisher from the fire station. And let's go and run over to the truck right here and put out the fire. There we go, sir. I'm fixing your truck. I literally just saved your truck. Oh, man. Okay, so this has been quite a hectic day. There's a lot of people just roaming around here, which is kind of scary. But anyways, I would say this has been a pretty successful day as a heavy cargo trucker here in Brookhaven. So, yeah, that's going to be it for today's episode. I really hope you enjoyed this one. And if you did, make sure to hit the like, subscribe button. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.